There's the money shot. There's the money shot. Where's the money shot? Hello there, ladies, gentlemen, aliens from other life forms. I am Ravi and Abattoir. And today we're going to be looking at all of the plant menu sources that Audi do. Now, if you don't know what Audi is, Audi is a shop, German based origin. Some would say it's a supermarket like Asda. We've got five sources that I want to share with you. Vegan Avergraved and Mustard. Vegan Blue Cheese. Vegan Caesar. Vegan Peri Peri Mayonnaise. Vegan Mayonnaise. We're going to find out which is the king sauce from Audi. All of these are vegan. In fact, Audi's plant menu range is very good and I would highly recommend it. Us vegans, we know that it's not a cheap dietary lifestyle. However, Audi is making that more affordable to the masses. So big up yourself. We're going to start off with the vegan Algrave Mustard. This one here. Fizzle this delicious mix of sweet agrave syrup and French Dijon mustard. We're going to look at the ingredients on the back here. All we can see, mustard, rapeseed oil and vinegar. We're going to give this one a go and see what it tastes like. It's the vegan agrave mustard. That's not bad. I quite like that. I don't know if you've ever tried kind of like a mustard Caesar, but it kind of reminds me of like a mustard Caesar. It's very good, and I imagine it's fairly good on a salad, which is what it's designed for. 7 out of 10. I would quite happily buy that again. An anticipated one, the vegan blue cheese. Dressed to impress with our cider vinegar, broad bean protein, black pepper and parsley. We're going to give this one a go and see what this one tastes like. I'm not so much of a big fan of this one. It's got a strange aftertaste. It's not one of my favourites. I would probably give it a miss. Four out of ten. It's not something I'll be buying again. Next we're going to go for the Vegan Caesar. They say, deliciously creamy with cider vinegar, broad bean protein and black pepper spice. Mm. Yeah, no, I like that. That is, uh, that's my favourite sauce so far. Um, an 8.5 out of 10. It's definitely one I'd buy again. Imagine over a salad. That is very, very good. The next one we're going to go for is the vegan Peri Peri Mayo. Made to spice up dinner time with a broad bean protein, cider vinegar, green chilies, and Peri Peri chilies. No coconut milk, which again is a bit of a surprise. I'm hoping that there's quite a lot of spice to this one. I'm hoping it, it does have a nice kick. I'm going to lap of that on the bread there. Generally, I'm quite disappointed in that. It tastes more of a Thousand Islands sauce rather than a Peri Peri Mayo. Because if you wanted a nice prawn cocktail, stick this on there. Honestly, not... Not the worst, as a Thousand Island dressings go, but it's definitely not vegan peri-peri mayo. Five out of ten. The reason why is it does taste very nice, but it's, it's the wrong description on the label here. It should be a Thousand Island dressing. Standard plant menu vegan mayonnaise. Creamy vegan mayonnaise. Made with white wine vinegar. So I'm hoping this is quite sharp. I'm going to look at the ingredients. There doesn't seem to be a lot of ingredients in here. So I wonder how these guys are making their sauces white. Very characteristic of vegan mayonnaise is that it's extremely white in colour. So what are we thinking in terms of the vegan mayonnaise on this one then? It's okay. It's, uh, it's not as good as the Hellman's vegan stuff. Don't be tempted to buy this one. Um, it's a lot cheaper in price, but you can taste the difference. And I would prefer um, the, the standard Hellman's Vegan Mayo. Um, but anyway, this will do. If you're 
having a house party and you don't want to use your expensive mayonnaise, give them the cheap shit. Which one was my least favourite? Well, it's got to be the vegan blue cheese. And Audi, as a punishment, because of your low score, we're going to do something we've never done on this channel before. We're going to do something experimental. We're going to down the whole bottle. Here we go. I warn you, I may become violently sick, but it's all in the mood for entertainment. We're going to give it a go. <laughs> Nah, jokes aside, it was in a cup, really.